Hello everybody, it's Juicy here, reacting to One Piece of the manga. This would be chapter 979. It's five o'clock right now, so it's just dropped on Manga Plus. Ah, I've been waiting for this, I can't wait to read it, but luckily I found something to pass the time while waiting for this past two weeks, which was watching Attack on Titan. I'm so glad <laughs> people seem to be liking those reactions because I've never reacted to anime before, but so far so good. It's been amazing, like I've reacted to the whole thing. I mean, I've watched the whole thing and now slowly I'm uploading each reaction. It's it's pff, absolutely fantastic, but this is One Piece, so that's what we're talking about right now. Um, before I start reading, I wanted to shout out Grant on Twitter. He is at Grant the Thief, that's the, uh, the handle. He finally caught up with the One Piece um, manga, so he's been uh, doing threads while he caught up. So uh, he was reading and then reacting while well he tweeted about his reactions, his uh, impressions, and the, the you know highlight panels and his you know his favorite things. It, it's hilarious. It's a whole bunch of threads if you want to go and check them out because they're. They're hilarious, he's great, and now he's finally caught up, so I guess today would be his first, um, well, read through of the chapter, just this chapter, because that's all there is, and then he waits with us every week, so, or whenever it comes out, because of course now it's gonna be more breaks due to the situation, which is completely fine, I understand, whenever it comes out, I'll read it. Uh, so yeah, shout out to Grant, <laughs> and, uh, and yeah, let's jump into the chapter, because I can't wait to read it. We met the Tobiropo in the uh, last chapter, 978. We met the, well, we knew two of them and then we met the other four. Uh, oh, of course, sorry if I read it wrong, it's Black Maria, I, don't, I think, not Black Mariah, I don't know why I put the H at the end in my head. Um, and then there's, uh, well, page one we knew, there's Ulti, which is apparently page one's sister, and then Sasaki, and then uh, who's who. Um, so yeah, these six, obviously looking beast, <laughs> I really wonder what the colors are going to be for them. And then, the, so while the party's going on at uh, Onigashima, there's like Queen uh, partying hard and the Apu DJing and everybody going nuts, but the Topiropa are too cool for that. So they're just hanging on the side on the couch, just talking about about stuff that they're not really supposed to be talking about. Like, what if Queen were to die tonight? <clears throat> And uh, in the meantime, the Straw Hats are cosplaying as the Beast Pirates <laughs> and uh, making their way stealthily to the battle that's likely to break out as soon as they meet, um, well, the bunch of everybody else. Um, I hope the microphone is fine, because I noticed while I was doing the um, Attack on Titan reactions that there's a, a whistle sometimes. I can't, I can't really tell, because sometimes it's there, sometimes it's, it's not, so I hope it's not here this time. Uh, because I only I only figure it out obviously after, and I normally don't edit these reactions, so hope it's not there. But yeah, let's jump into the chapter because it's now ah five oh three, so it's definitely out. Let's refresh the page. Let's go. Let's go. Yes. Okay. Next one is May twenty fourth. Fair enough. Absolutely. Okay. Family problem. Oh right, because Kaido has a kid. And we still don't know who it is, but apparently, based on what they said, um, well, what Ulti said in the latest chapter, it's a thing that happens, Kaido having family trouble, and it's always a very annoying thing. I'm not really sure what to make of that, but if this is called family problem, I guess we're gonna find out. Okay, so, Gang Bages on My Family, Volume 26, the Tuntatas find the ship adrift. Oh, oh, oh! Wait, what? Is that... No, no! It... It's Pound? Isn't it? No, I'm wrong. Okay, it, uh, I'm probably wrong. But... <laughs> so... So he's not dead? Really? Um, okay, I guess. <laughs> I guess that could be Pound, unless I'm completely mistaken, because that often happens. But let's jump into the actual chapter, okay. The, 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 the ship is so cute, okay. Family problem. <clears throat> At this moment, Orochi is dangerously complacent, and he's surrounded by beautiful women. Thanks to the reports from his spy Kanjuro, he knows everything that the Akazaya are up to. Everything, everything, up to the very end, because there's this bird clearly a drawing of Kanjuro um, dropping a letter on um, Orochi's hands. His plan is perfect. The samurai's retribution has been completely headed off. 
No longer will he be tormented by the ghosts of the Kazuki clan. No, it doesn't. I don't think. But contrary to his belief, the raid of Onigashima begins. Yes, he doesn't know. So he thinks that um, his counterattack paid off and they managed to stop um, the Akasaya 9 and everybody else by blowing up the bridges and destroying the ships. <laughs> no, bitch. Okay. Kinemon leads the Eastern forces. Look at them all cosplaying as Beast Pirate. But why not Sicilian? Is Sicilian too cool for this? Like, he doesn't get to <laughs> wear a Beast Pirate outfit? Everybody else is. Oh, oh Kinemon. Kinemon looked in Beast with the horns. Denjiro looking even more Beast with the. Oh, wow. I mean, it's a very simple outfit, I guess. It's like. <laughs> it's, you know, it's leather and, and the cape and that. But they look cool, so I like it. Kinemon leads the Eastern forces. Denjiro leads the Southern forces. Their total manpower exceeds 5,000. <laughs> oh, please, can we see Hyogoro? Can we see Hyogoro properly in the outfit? Please, I'll die. <laughs> you can see him in the back, but you don't see what he's wearing. Law's pirate submarine proceeds. Bless you, bless you people, fan artists who put Law in the Beast Pirate outfit. <laughs> Especially the ones that made the little comic of him reacting to <laughs> having been forced to wear it, because that's it's hilarious. I mean, I wish I could see it, <laughs> but okay. Lost Pirate Submarine proceeds, carrying the Akasaya Samurai under the sea. Okay, so they're going from the back and then, yeah. They move about undetected, converging on Kaido and Orochi. So East Forces, South Forces, Law. <laughs> they, they, I, I love the little... Um, recap comics explaining like the uh, back when in one and we had one and now there's one in Onigashima <laughs> with the chibi it's so cute Kanjiro was on his way to the castle with Momonosuke okay oh but he didn't okay but as Kinemon correctly guessed he had not yet made his way to Orochi's side but he didn't even send a message that's okay that's really really convenient but also why why wouldn't he I've never been in these tunnels. I had no idea. It would be so confusing. Great, get lost. We love that. Yes, get some Zoro in your head and get lost for a few hours. So in the meantime, we can do our thing. And Momo is there like, <laughs> bound, baby. Okay. From the guard's perspective, I'm just another one of the enemy samurai. I don't have time to deal with them. Oh, oh, okay. He just pummels people passing through. I need to report on what Kinemon is up to. But how do I get to Lord Orochi? This is extremely... Oh, oh, Momo. Momo. Momo is looking at the dagger that one of the guards dropped uh, after uh, Kanjuro pummeled him. Okay, that's okay. And then I think we hear the, the, the sounds of the party already, so they're close. But is, is he, is, has he picked up the blade? Because we don't see it. Like, we, we cut off. We cut away. But, hmm, okay. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what to think about Momo with the blade, but he needs one. Like, whether he manages to use it just to free himself or actually to do some damage, I'm happy that Momo is armed because, yes, the poor thing. Okay. The enemy still doesn't know that an army of 5,000, of over 5,000, is bearing down upon them. <sighs> yeah, but there's a, there's a shitload of them there. So, yeah, it's great. Mm, yeah. Okay, let's see. Um, Everyone left. Don't worry, we'll catch up. Is that Frankie? I saw these things in battle at Fishman Island. They're not things, Jimbe. It's the... <laughs> Frankie! Wow! It's the Black Rhino FRU4. <laughs> but you can call it Black Rhino. And the Brachio Tank 5. I'm Commander... <laughs> this is adorable, stop. I'm Commander Chopper and I run this tank. This is... This is... This is pirates. Yes, <laughs> and their trinkets. <laughs> so these two things that are stored in the sunny for whenever the need arises. <laughs> Here they go, the two machines built by Frankie. There's Okay, the one looks like a rhino, but the other one, I mean, Brachiotank is supposed to be a Brachiosaurus? It's just got the long neck, but I can't really see a dinosaur anywhere there. It's like a turtle with a long neck, <laughs> which fair enough, you know, <laughs> it's great. Okay. <laughs> and Frank has got the like the hair shaped as two horns. Okay. Yay, now we can travel safely. You look so cool, Chavro. I can't believe this wasn't sunny the whole time. You're in good hands, soldier. <laughs> Chavro, relax. <laughs> Where did Luffy go? Oh, Jimba, Jimba is in the pirates, the beast pirates out of his belt. Let's go, Jimba. Let's go. Well, he saw Eustace Kid and his crew run right toward the front door, so... 
They have no idea what Kinemon's plan is. Don't worry, I'll go and bring them back. <laughs> you? That's only going to make things worse. Yes, that's not <laughs> Nami. <laughs> Nami Sanji Chopper and who's up going? The hell did you think is gonna happen? No, that's not how it's supposed to go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, Sanji, okay. So, <laughs> I'm just, I want to see all the outfits, like everybody's. But then I don't know what's up. You know what? <laughs> Jimbe, Jimbe, bless you. Jimbe, you don't know. You, you haven't been with them uh, enough. Like, obviously, you just arrived, but even before, you haven't been with them enough to know what you just let happen by letting them two go ahead what oh oh my god it's all good gonna find kanjiro because they both get lost <laughs> wait a second wait a second let me keep reading but then don't know Doro said luffy's only good to make things worse i'll go stop him he's only going to get lost <laughs> of course at the same four just going oh, no <laughs> i love the the difference in their faces like First with Luffy, they were like angry with the with the pointy teeth, and now they're just crying desperate because like, what? How do we deal with this? <laughs> oh bless! But who cares about those idiots? This is our chance for a little rendezvous in the battlefield, Nami. Sanji, get lost! <laughs> and then <laughs> she just hid inside the. <laughs> she hid inside the tank. We're all full. <laughs> See you, Sanji. Oh, oh, Carrot is in the outfit as well. Of course she would be. Amazing, amazing. Okay. Get out of there, Usopp. Who said you could be in heaven? <laughs> You're gonna aim this cannon better than me. Give it up, man. Usopp making points. I am so... I feel so bad for not pointing out Usopp being the, the king of the snipers in the latest uh, chapter. Like, he saw those, those guards from that far away and then just sniped them out of, you know, back to sleep and then, yeah. Nothing to it. Let's keep going. That was so great. Uh, I mean, maybe I did like say something, but I didn't properly applaud <laughs> Usopp's uh, observation hockey and sniper skills. But anyway, okay, that was good. So they're okay. Nami, Usopp, uh, Shinobu, Carrot, and Chopper are in the brachio tank. Get out there, Usopp. Okay, blah. Ooh, wanna take a ride? Backseat up, Robin. <laughs> Robin. Okay, listen. <laughs> I can I can go on and on all I want about them being um, in skimpy outfits and stuff that are not really great for battle, but I appreciate seeing them in those. Let's be honest, all of them. <laughs> so yeah, Robin, show me show me Robin's outfit properly. Wanna take a ride? Back seats open. What are you offering? How nice. That's very kind. <laughs> oh my God, Brooke. <laughs> <laughs> That's very kind of you. And, and Frankie's like, huh? Why is it you? The vaccine for chicks. R Frankie, Frankie, listen. There's nothing wrong with some good male bonding, yo. <laughs> Brooke, <laughs> I love that. And they're just running away. And Robbie's like, um, I wanted to get on. <laughs> Commander Chopper, let's fall out and dock up at the rear of the island. Over and out. <laughs> Why are they <laughs> communicating like this? Hey, Robin, come up here and sit with me. No, thank you. <laughs> That's Sanji. Sanji, stop. The top of the... Goodness. How is she comfortable? I mean, I mean, I guess... <laughs> you know what? I don't even... <laughs> Why do I try? <laughs> it's, it's a bikini. It's a, it's a leather bikini, basically, with straps and stuff. Um... I guess, yeah, sure, uh, it, it can work. And she looks great. So so I'm just gonna move on because, <laughs> damn. Okay, the top of the tank is bound to get dusty. Let's just walk. <laughs> look at them, they're so badass though. Robin and Jimbe, so badass. Look, look, at, look at Jimbe's uh, jacket. Yes, yes, I approve, I approve. You folks are as lively as ever, but when everyone is worked up about fighting, the key will be having someone who can calmly observe the state of the battle. What a mature point of view. It's good to have you with us. Oh yeah, I, oh, I love these two interacting. Yes, yes, more. I want to make myself useful for my first battle on the crew. Who is spying? There's a rustling of leaves and someone dot dot dotting? Who is 
Mm, okay, but from, is that that's far away? Because we see Jim Bear Robin walking away, and this person is in the bushes far back. Don't like it. Don't like it. I just need a moment to appreciate the panel of Robin and Jim Bear. Yes, beautiful. Yes, we love to see it. Okay, good. I I also love Robin's horns. Like I I prefer the horns like that rather than just pointy straight. So yes. Anyway, let's move on. Hey, all of you. I don't want to see. Okay, I'm uh, okay. <laughs> There's a double page spread. I don't want to see what's on the left. Hey, all of you. He, it's Master Kaido himself. What an honor. You you um <laughs> you were not really that you know kind to him uh, in the in the previous chapter. But anyway, ever so long time no see. You know that's not how a fancy lady actually talks, right? Are you enjoying your drinks? I got nothing from. I got nothing to gain from drinking with scrubs. I only want to drink with you, Kaido. Okay, relax, uh, Sasaki, whoever you are. Sure, so oh, nice. Oh, 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 that's Black Maria. Okay, okay. She's huge, but she's human. I mean, humanoid. I guess she's a giant. Because uh, there was like some, some talk of the fact that she could be another creature. But actually, we had seen her legs in the back um, in two, three chapters ago. When you saw all the legs of the Tobiropo, there were the six pair of legs just far back, and I guess those were hers. Um, so yeah, okay. But I love the outfit, though. That's a mm, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful panel. Okay. Oh, Jack! Hello! Didn't even see you. <laughs> Sorry. Sure, sounds good. We'll go to the hall later. Today is all about mingling freely. I was planning to introduce you to Lin Lin, but she's still changing. We can do that later. Okay. I guess. But while we've been carrying on, something's come up. That's why you were forced to wait. Okay. Come on, get it together already. <laughs> Ulti! <laughs> we'll knock it off. I know, I know. But the thing is, it wasn't me who summoned you here. Huh? Then who asked for us? It was me. It's... Uh, someone... Is that King? I see, I see a wing and the uh, um, um, leather-clad foot, I guess. So, King? Okay, I, I love the panel though of Kaido looking massive and sitting on at the top of these uh, these steps, and then the Tobiropo looking onto him um, from from below. Yes, that's good. That's good stuff. I like it. And Jack on the side. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I feel like oh, oh yeah, there's Jack too. <laughs> that's just how I feel about Jack. <laughs> anyway. That's king, okay. I call for them. Animal Kingdom priority perform a king. Kaido. King. King, this was your idea. That's right, some of you wouldn't bother to show up if you knew that ahead of time, wouldn't you? What, the fact that he called them? Who's who, Sasaki? Yeah, you got me. You were formerly captains of your own pirate crews. Were they now? Which, when, who? <laughs> Let's write down more questions. I know that you're angling for a spot among the lead performers. The organization is a meritocracy. You climb the ranks with skill. Of course we're aiming high. Shut up and stay in your place. Hey, knock off the fighting. This is a celebration. Speak up, King. Why did you summon them? Okay. I, I, I just keep looking back at Black Maria. <laughs> she looks great. Anyway. But she, okay, she is... If Kaido stood up, they would be maybe the same size, judging by this. So she's not a giant. She's just big. She's she's bigger than King. But and also maybe bigger than Kinemon and the others. I'm not sure. I mean, it doesn't really matter too much right now. I'm just trying to. Yeah. I summoned them because I got tipped off about your problem. I thought they might be needed. That's a good point. Bao Huang, recite the day schedule. Yes, sir. And someone from the ceiling says, Yes, sir. Do do we know? Do we know? What? Um, I don't. Uh, I'm not okay. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go back and try and understand what this this person is. This. I don't. I can't. <laughs> anyway, Bo Huang is speaking from up there. Master Queen is currently emceeing the show on the Golden Festival stage, but this is it's it's like a con. 
It feels like a con <laughs> on the Golden Festival stage. We have Queen, <laughs> please. The three lead performers are in, in Fukuroku, you will be holding a toast. And then Shogun Orochi and Master Kaido will give a speech. <laughs> Is this actually like the program of a con? <laughs> um, uh, okay, sure. And upon the... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, did, did we... Had we seen her before? No, maybe not, but she looks a bit like... No, I'm, I'm, I'm getting confused. Like one of the Oniwa Banshu, but maybe not, maybe not. And upon the arrival of the Big Mom pirate ship, we will have Master Kaido and Big Mom join together to formally announce the World's Strongest Pirate Alliance. World's Strongest, yes, yes, for now. <laughs> anyway, following that, Master Kaido will have a very important announcement. That is all. She, she is so excited. Like, uh, yes, announcements. <laughs> Flying squirrel smile for... Oh, she's a, she's a, oh, she's a sugar glider. Let me see her fly. <laughs> Animal Kingdom Pirates headliner Bao Huang. Okay, she, okay. And that's really cute. The, the, the paper on her head with the one eye. That's really nice. I'm sure that's like symbolic of something. I, I'm going to go and look it up after because she looks very lovely. I really, really like the design. And with the giant fan at her back. An important announcement, it's not like you to play coy, Master Kaido. It's ever so annoying. <laughs> That's ulti. Yeah, I know. But if I lead with that, it'll only cause confusion. In short, this is the task I want you to perform. I need you to find and bring back my idiot son Yamato, who disappeared earlier today. Yamato. That's, that's a very unexpected name. Yamato. <laughs> okay. I guess. Sure, we don't know him. Unless we know him by another name. I don't know, but uh, Yamato is Kaido's kid. Sure. Who disappeared earlier today. That sounds like a formidable task. That's Black Maria. I take it that your major announcement involves young master Yamato. That's correct, I see. So young master, is it just because he's, you know, Kaido is the master, so the son is a young master? Or is he also young, truly, like a young kid? Oh, what a pain! It is your stupid family problem! <laughs> Page one is about to pop a vein, it's like, hey! <laughs> okay, and what happens if we bring him back safely? I'll give you the right to directly challenge any lead performer of your choosing. How about that? Are you kidding? I'm in! Oh, that's what they were talking about uh, before, right? So it's gonna be Queen. Any complaints? Not at all. Hey, hey! Oh, and there's Jack. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't understand why this is happening. <laughs> I'm so sorry, uh, but uh, okay. And uh, so, but why is it? What? What is Yamato? Who is Yamato? Why does he disappear? And why is it hard to find him? Oh, was he the one that was spying on on Robin and Frankie? Maybe. Maybe, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. That's my guess. Funk, funk, okay, okay, yeah, they're going, they're going, funk, funk. Don't let me see the next page. Now scream! It's the guy from Udon. Oh, oh, they're already there! They're already there! No, but, oh, they're not, oh, they're actually with them! They're, they're, well, mingling with the actual beast pirates. And that's Luffy just standing on the head of one. Where, no, where did he go, stupid Jaggy? He doesn't even know the first thing about Odin's struggle. What if he screws everything up? Luffy, you're shouting this thing? Luffy, Luffy bless you, but shut up. <laughs> hey, have you seen Jaggy? Jaggy? Of course he doesn't know. He doesn't know who is... <laughs> he doesn't know who are pirates and who are beast pirates. You know what I mean? Who is our allies and who is the enemy? <laughs> and so, of course, because they're all dressed the same. Oh my goodness. Uh, have I seen you somewhere before? Huh? Oh, look at all this tasty food, though. Go up. <laughs> eh, what is this? It's Oshiruko. Who wants to eat that crab while we're drinking? Wait, who is... Who is that's not Luffy shouting that. Oh, look at all this tasty food, though. Okay. Eh, what is this? It's Oshiruko. Who wants to eat that crab while we're drinking? I think whoever shouted this dropped the Oshiruko in, on Luffy's head. Oh? Oshiruko? Yeah. They made too much of it in the kitchen. So they brought some out here. It's sweet, you can have that with drinks. Dump out that sweet red bean soup is useless here. Beach. Beach, you're wasting food. 
I mean, Sanji's not there, but but Luffy's there. Toss it out in front of a Koboreta. Luffy, Luffy, no. Luffy, no. Toss it out in front of Okobora Town. Ha 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 ha. Good idea. They'll happily suck the dirt dry. You never... Tama. Oh God. Oh God, he's mad. Oh no. Oh baby. Oh baby, I get you. Oof. Oof. Ooh. Yeah, ha ha. Those beggars should be happy. They're alive at all. You never had that stuff before? Never. What, a, what an extravagant food. I've never had such a nice birthday again. And then Luffy's like... Beach. <laughs> Ooh. <sighs> ah, that's not good. But you were just going on about um Jaggy ruining the plan, so please hold it in. They're gonna get it. They're gonna get it. Just not yet. I, I, I think, unless it's good. That the, no, it's not. I don't think it is. It's not good if it causes Arrakis already. Because he's alone. And, uh, yeah, no. Yeah, no, he should... Ah, oh my goodness. <sighs> well, but I get it, though. Mm, ooh, okay, this was good. This was good. Ah, I have so much more, like to go on and, and uh, ah, think about stuff and go watch other people's reactions to probably things I've missed, let's face it. Uh, but, okay, this was nice. Yamato, okay? Like, I can only think of other anime and manga with the name Yamato. I, I can't... Uh, I don't associate it with anything in here, so there's just someone uh, by that name, someone we don't know, I think. I hope. I really hope. I'm not <laughs> forgetting something important if I am. <laughs> Please forgive. Um, but yeah, okay, that was good. Wasn't it? It was... It felt long, wasn't it? Oh, wait, it's not finished? Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, 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 it is. Um, I, I think it was about the same length as others, but um, I don't know. Felt like a lot of nice bits of information that we needed. So, okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're going on. Again, I, I, I have a feeling, even though it probably sounds obvious, so it's not gonna happen, but they're both lost, so they're bound to find each other, uh, Kanjiro and Zoro. Or not. Maybe not. But uh, and also, I'm pretty sure Yamato is the one spying on... Um, on Robin and Jimbe, who look amazing. <laughs> oh, please, please flood Twitter with fan art of Robin and Jimbe just being, yes, 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 yes. I <laughs> love them. Okay, uh, loved it. I'm gonna go watch other people's reactions right now. I hope you enjoyed mine, and I will see you for the next chapter. Bye.